Hi, I'm Andrew Sosson with Benchmark Mortgage in Newport Beach, and I'm here with Brian Boggs of Coldwell Banker. We're here today to talk about what we think are our top five golf courses in Orange County that we like to play. Great, so number five is going to be Mile Square Park in Fountain Valley. Uh, Mile Square has got two courses, the Players Course and the Classic Course. Um, I like the Classic Course the most, it's fun. You're just more of a classic guy. A little more classic. Why. I'm more classy. Of, I'm more of a player. Player, he's a player, I'm classy. Yeah. And don't let this video fool you. So Mile Square, again, two courses, 36 holes, pick which one you want. Um, it's it's a really good value, uh, relatively inexpensive for the quality of course you get. It's always in pretty good shape. They always have really good greens going there. Their golf carts are pretty fast too, so I do enjoy that, that, you know, the golf carts get moving pretty good. Cool. Uh, number four course I love a lot is really close to my place here in Huntington Beach. So Meadowlark Golf Course. Awesome place, um, small, short course. You can use every club in the bag when you're playing. A little history on it. One of Tiger Woods' first coaches was the head pro there. He recently passed away. Uh, so it is a really neat course. John Anselmo, he was a really cool coach there. And uh, again, fun course to play. Easy, walkable place. Uh, number three of number the top three. five courses in Orange County, public courses in Orange yeah. County, is uh, Monarch Beach Golf Links, and that is in Dana Point. It's right over by the Ritz Carlton, Dana Point. Ocean views, really beautiful course, kind of pricey, but uh, always kept in really good shape. Uh, it's tough, really tough off the tee, a lot of out of bounds. Um, I think I shot 105 the first time I was there. Awesome, good round. 74 the next time I was you there. You cheated probably. I cheated. I Number did. two course is Oak Creek. That's in Irvine. This is a Tom Fazio designed course. Really well manicured, gorgeous course. One of the best practice facilities I've ever been on before. So really great setup. Cool clubs is there if you get your club fitting. There's all kind of great instructions and stuff done as well. Uh, but really nice, really nice, well maintained and well manicured course. Yeah. So number one, probably not gonna be a big surprise to most people who are familiar, who are familiar with Orange County yeah. golf, but Pelican Hill, uh, cream of the crop when it comes to uh, public golf courses in Orange County, right on the coast, obviously in Newport Beach. Um, it is two 18 hole courses, north and south. The south course has uh, three or four holes right on the ocean, a couple of par threes awesome. that are beautiful. Um, awesome looking houses, uh, you know, 10, 15, 20 million dollar houses and more that you're kind of playing uh, right up against. Uh, the whole thing is right on a hill, great food, uh, awesome place to get married. There's, it's just a really, really uh, special place. It's fun. It's, it's by far one of the best places to, to go. It should be on everybody's bucket list for sure. For sure. So to stay tuned here to the end of the video, we are going to be giving away a free round of golf of one of these top five places that we pick. Um, so we'll pick which one, maybe Pelican Hill, maybe Meadowlark, not too sure, we'll kind of see. Uh, but for a chance to go to one of these courses, comment below with a story of your favorite course and why. Uh, we'd love to hear some of the stories of these courses and then Andrew and I will also chime in a little bit with some of the stories of us playing some of these courses and some great times we've had there as well. For sure. So I wanted to give you a quick market update. Uh, the mortgage market uh, continues to have uh, very low interest rates. The rates have ticked up a bit uh, since the last market update we yeah. did. However, um, still all time lows, uh, probably low, th I'm sorry, high threes to low fours is about what we're seeing on a 30 year fixed. Um, a lot of the uh, changes that are happening over the next year with regard to some of the tax plan uh, coming up that was been proposed will have a big impact on getting a mortgage. So. Uh, give us a call if you want to discuss your specific situation and how the new tax plan might impact uh, your ability to finance or, or own a home. Yeah, and in the real estate market, we're here, this is one of the best times for a buyer to really kind of get in um, and make a great purchase though too. So inventory is still low, still technically a seller's market, but we're seeing some of those summer listings that were overpriced to start with. We've seen some great reductions, so buyers can kind of come in now and get some great opportunities to buy. Um, and also sellers are taking advantage of the market, so it's really kind of a funky market that way in that there's opportunities for both buyers and sellers uh, depending on what they're looking for, where you want to go, and what you want to you know, get out of that sale. Great, so again, this is Andrew Soss, Benchmark Mortgage, and Brian Boggs with Coldwell Banker in Newport yep. Beach. We appreciate you uh, watching the video. Yep, thanks.